Yo, baby, patch those time. Oh my god, it finally came out. What? Why does Rashi look like super tan here? So, uh, let's go over patch notes. New Roxy, of course. Uh, we saw our old animation and all that stuff, but I will be looking on Murali's Twitter because he got. He has pretty great translation. So follow the homie, smash the like button, subscribe, turn on notifications, all that good stuff. So first of all, let's see whatever we uncover first. Let's take a look at the banner, right? And then we'll go over her like skills and stuff. Love, hey, yeah, English, bro. So, oh, so here's the multiplier for her new like human grace. Uh, six, 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 ten percent. At level one is three percent. Yikes! They want you to six, six so bad. So the banner has New Year's mono, green mono. Shitter catastrophes. <laughs> oh, you got Freya and Freyer. That's that's great. Thonar, that's fantastic. These this middle row right here sucks. Great, 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 great. Not so good. Okay, because she's like new. Uh, not good, not good. Okay, okay, and new. <laughs> so overall, pretty nice. It's a six hundred banner. Uh, what's it called? Chainsaw of Vengeance. Roxy the Rage. <laughs> okay. Interesting, interesting. Uh, let's go back. Oh, let's go over her skills first. Marilly, the homie. Where you at, dog? Okay, so her skills or passive increase your critical rate by 40% for each human ally participating in battle. Goes to her. So if it's three people on the field, I imagine she gets 120% crit chance. So she's gonna always crit. And if a human ally uses a single target attack skill and the critical hit occurs, 300% of your attack power uh, at the at the start of the battle is like dealt as damage. So basically she has the Escanor point dot damage over time guard, basically. And then her link y'all saw at one six it gives three percent attack related stats to human, but at six six it gives ten. Uh also. Uh let's go back over here to patch notes. We got a new story revealing mastermind open. It looks like I don't know if I just had to guess, maybe she's like I don't know. Just a villain that <laughs> the catastrophes have to fight. I always thought wasn't the catastrophes like bad from the jump regardless? So I don't, I don't know. Uh, let's take a look at what this new, this uh, new card set does. Let's go over here to the, the handy dandy Yandex <laughs> uh, real quick. If it wants to load. Okay. Uh, I was just telling you where to get the cards. My bad. I thought it was at the set. Wait, it should give you the set. It's just cards. I guess they're not for a set yet. So we got Meliodas and Zeldris Relic. Let's go over AMs real quick. At the start of the battle, give yourself a 30% chance. A 30% increase. What chance? Can't read. 30% increase in basic stats for two turns. And if you don't take damage during the enemy's turn, give yourself the same effect at the start of an ally's turn. In addition, the basic stats of Demon Tribe allies increase by 5% for each debuff on yourself. On him? Up to three times. So I don't know how many buffs you can get of this 30% basic stats. I'm guessing it might just be if they do attack him, he gets one. But I, if he doesn't take damage the entire turn, he gets another one. I thought maybe if they like use one card and they don't do anything else, it would have been broken if he got that. Imagine. <laughs> like if they use three cards, right? He wouldn't get any buff. But then if they just use one and they like skip two slots, imagine he got two like buffs. That'd be like ridiculous. But I still feel like this is fine. So however many debuffs on him, everybody else gets five percent like basic stats. I don't know if that's enough. If they made that ten, I feel like it would have like made a difference. But moving on to Zelda soon. Whoa, where is he? Merely, you did not do it. Oh no, I think I have it oh, somewhere in Discord over here. Uh real quick, real quick. It's right around the corner. Trust, 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 trust me, trust me, trust me. It was in the VC chat. Where is it? Oh my god. Okay, uh here it is. Zelda the Shirelic. Uh one debuff effect on the enemy. The basic stats of a, a demon allies is goes up by three percent. So if you have if you apply debuffs on the enemy, you get more basic stats, and your damage increases uh, by 4% up to 5 times. I, I, I'm guessing it's for this part, or is it for all of it? If it's up to 5 times, I still feel like that's great. So, Zelda's W. Uh, Relic's pretty much looking good. I, I wouldn't say, like, broken or anything like that, but it, it does look good. We got a new... F oh, Freya. Why are you looking at me like that, bro? She looking good. She got the, the Matador skin rogue. Looks very good. Roxy TOF outfits looking dummy. She got the chainsaws. Oh, I can't wait. Uh, then you got the tickets as well, territory. Um, What is this? It's a step up bundle. Huh? Interesting. So you get what? 
57 tickets and 150 gems interesting why did they give her so many tickets <laughs> like i guess you could buy this if you don't just want to buy the outright like this is like 76 dollars for me but like i guess this is like this is like what 40 plus 20 so it's like it, this might be as much as like this and like these two packs right here i don't know i'm just doing quick maps and then we got the cheap one and then you got uh a gem weekly pack nice they got cosmetic upgrades really don't need that <laughs> pendant pack eh. anvils they always drop anvils it's pretty good and then also new character ability unity added basically they've given graces to like people moving forward bro it like i i feel like if it calls for it i don't think they're gonna give it to everybody but basically it's like the grace they, they'll show what level it is if they're six six that means this gets like what 10% attack related or something like that. Uh, so yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know, man. Hopefully it's not too often. They bring out somebody who, who you have the six, six, you know, maybe they only do it for like disasters moving forward just to like make them, you know, people summon for them. Cause usually people just like get one copy and dip, uh, the conditions of requiring rewards for the bra shop and opening higher shops will be changed from accumulated purchases. Okay. Uh, super bra shop list. Do we care? <laughs> <laughs> uh, improved color vision support. Okay. Improved team formation menu added a filter function that allows you to check the information for each character in your team formation menu. Nice. All right. W, uh, seven calamity special login bonus. We get basically, is it, is this a multi a day or a single? I imagine. Yeah. I think it's a multi a day because we get 14. You would need 10 for a multi, so that, that wouldn't make sense if we get 14. So I guess it's a multi a day. That's pretty nice. Cool, cool, cool. I think it's a separate banner from Roxy. Or if it's not, that's even a bigger W. Or I might just be an idiot completely, and this just might be, you may you might need 10 tickets <laughs> to do a multi. But I'll see once I uh, log into the game later today. Diamond payback event, you got to use 900 gems, which is weird because the, the banner is 600. So if you go 6-6, six, six, uh, you'll easily get this. But if you go for one rotation, you won't even be able to get this. You'll just be able to stop right here, which is dumb. Unless you buy cosmetics for other characters and you spend a total of 900. Also, this last ticket, they want you to spend gems basically to get this ticket. You can either, I don't know if you could pick or you have a shot at one of these five characters. If you could pick... I would say Donar is like the easiest pick of your life, honestly, if you don't have her. Or if you really is, are missing anybody. You can make the case for Jormigan, Freyr, Miguel. You can make the case for all of them, bro. I mean, she was free in like some missions a while ago. So if you don't have Green Brunhild, I mean, if hey, you know, if you need it, go for it. Uh, A new event. Nice, nice, nice furniture and stuff basically uh exchange items yep 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 and then that little map area is where you can get some pendants essay coins and all that stuff uh it's the mission to complete it disaster battles return and exchange open you can fight roxy now it's always valenti bro they never swap out this valenti it's either valenti camilla and easton and they always change easton and the Camilla one this is Valenti stays here, I guess, because she's like the, the smart person of the group. So you can get, oh, it's seven. No, it's eight gems. What? Eight times three, 24 gems. That's pretty good. Uh, almost a multi. <laughs> and then you can get the bunny outfit missing and you get the, the Eastern outfit. They did rerun with this outfit or well, this event. I mean, Hawk Pass, you get Freya outfit. That is mad new. I don't know why they're not showing it here because I, I know. Oh, wait, wait, here it is. <laughs> okay. You got Muay Thai. <laughs> Q sag and then you got new Freya Matador outfit. Her hair looks good, bro. Like very, very good. I like that. Battle event. Nobody gives a F. Fix an issue with the effect of serpent. Well, Yormigan was not applied correctly. Fix the problem where intermittently you cannot enter the annihilation battle. Oh, I actually dealt with this. Fix an issue where your guidance pop-up was displayed repeatedly in story. Fix an issue where activation of conditions and recovery targets for special combat skills effects uh were incorrect. Change the description of mission and training cave. Change some in-game text. So, all in all, that is it. Thank y'all for watching. If y'all enjoyed the video, smash the like button, subscribe, turn on notifications, all that good stuff. Let me know if you're gonna summon for this Roxy. I think she's very good. Also, I forgot to go over. Her oh man, I'm so unprofessional. Her skills. This her first skill is flood. Her second skill is uh spike AOE. So.
make with that of what you will. So her her dot damage and her passive only counts towards single target attack. So if you crit on her AOE, it won't proc. You have to do a single target. So peace out. I'll see y'all.